Wanted to say sorry for the lack of upload frequency. I've had some footage for quite a while, but I'm married with three kids and I've got three dogs. So life gets a little busy, especially when I work full time and I don't get to work on cars full time. It's just what I do for fun. All right, so I'm putting everything back together on the car, getting the alternator put back on, getting some of the belts put back on, and we're gonna see if it's gonna start. So clearly it didn't work. I don't think the car is supposed to sound like a bunch of rocks in a clothes dryer when you try to start it. So it leads me to believe that a couple things might be happening. Maybe somebody put the engine together with no apex seals in it. And at any rate, there is absolutely no compression. Tried to spin the motor around uh, by the eccentric shaft and there's uh, compression one time in a full rotation. So motor's going to have to come out. Looks like I got myself a winter project. Well, I traded some spare 240 parts for this GTS passenger seat. It's in pretty good shape, so I'm going to take the crappy Acura Integra seat out and put this in, because that's what's supposed to be in there, and we'll see how it works. Take a look at this really cool stuff. So, can't pull the seat out now because, oh man, they did a really, really nice welding job on this thing. Uh, the seat is welded to the car, so I'll have to cut all this bull crap out. Thanks a lot to the really cool previous owner of this car. It's way better. My head doesn't hit the ceiling now. most confusing box ever. What's going on here? Oh my god. Actual Corolla console. HVAC bezel. Alright, actually get the interior back together a little bit more now. This thing's in good shape, but it's nasty. We're gonna wash it up.
it for this time. If you like what you saw, make sure you like and subscribe. And if you have any questions at all, make sure you leave them in the comment section below and I'll be happy to answer them. See you next time.